Hi Cancer, welcome to your Week Ahead Taroscope with me, Raphael from Radiant Reality. It's an absolute pleasure to have you. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for joining me. If you haven't already, please don't forget to like, share and hit that subscribe button if you should so choose. If you are already a continued subject, I love you so much. Thank you so much for all of your support. It really does mean everything. With that said, if you would like to book a personal tarot reading with me, you can do so on the website address below. And if you would like to join my mailing list for offers and all kinds of uh, monthly bits and bobs, you can do so on the web link below. It's all in the description. Check it out. With that said, I would like to bless all of my decks of cards with all forms of love, light, peace, prosperity and abundance. And I pray that the messages that come through are ultimately clear and concise and they help you on your path to your highest vibrational good. So let's have a look see what are you removing releasing or letting go of from your life path this week my lunar brothers and sisters let's have a look see what are you letting go of you're letting go of the empress right so you're letting go of um really other people's idea of what abundance is other people's ideas of what beauty is it really feels for me like this week you're bringing everything back to yourself and this is really interesting because if you see your personal month if you see the month video for cancer you'll see what i mean why this is so interesting because it feels like you're wrapping up a big personal cycle um, and i really like this for you because it really does put you in a position of strength if you're letting go of the empress you're letting go of other people's ideas of what beauty abundance uh, communication expression and ultimately uh, you know prosperity you're letting go of what other people's ideas of those things are and being more true to yourself with it so what is at the heart or at the meat of the matter this week what are you working on and this week you get the ten of swords you're working on letting go right you're working on saying that is the end of that that is the end of where i'm at that is the end of an era and it really is cancer this is time for you to part ways with something with someone there is something in your life now that has come to its natural end and you need to allow that end to happen in order for you to move forward the thing about the ten of swords is it's a shit card it's a really actually very often a really awful experience as well because it's so final but the beauty of this card is it's the end of the cycle it's the closing and the clearing of the decks and this is where you can move on it's this is where the cycle starts again and you can move into something else into something completely different so what you're being asked to do is to work on this week your ability to let go of something you know and cancerians I'm a moon sign cancer we have a tendency to cling to things right this is the week where you learn not to cling this is the week where you learn to just let go uh, the crab usually will hold on to something till you know it will snap its leg off <laughs> and then run away right well you don't need to all you need to do is let go and that's fine the key to the week is the strength card dig deep find your courage find the courage that it takes in order to walk away from something because when you let a chapter go when you close the book on a certain chapter and you acknowledge that something needs to change and that you are moving forward into something else the most amazing thing happens you discover who you truly are and you start being more authentic you start living from that heart space leo strength you know the heart the backbone you find that inner strength that courage and you come back to your heart of hearts and say you know what this is who i am and this is how i choose to proceed from here on in it's all about you this week my loves uh, i know that's difficult as an experience but you better get used to it check out your monthly tarot scope and you will understand why i wish you an abundance of all of that good stuff have an amazing week let me know how it shapes up for you in the comments take care and i'll see you very soon for more videos